Hello and welcome. This is Mr. Parsons. I'm going to show you today how your papers ought to look and how to make them look that way. I'm using a Mac right now. Uh, maybe I'll make another one for PC. Anyway, this is what your paper ought to look like. On the left side, we're going to have everything justified to the left. Uh, you're going to put at the very top your name. I'll use my own name. So there it is. Then we need the class. You're in English 4, and it's helpful to me if you have your section number. So I'll say period 4. Whatever period in, you're in, just put that. Then uh, you're going to put my name. And at the very end, you put the date. Uh, if it happens to be today's date, you can just enter, enter, and it does that for you. The next step is to make a header. So I'm going to double click here at the top of the page. And then I can edit the elements up there. So the thing that I'm going to look for is page number. So I just click here on insert page number. It's already on the right side. So I can just type my name here. I moved it. I moved my cursor uh, from the right to the left. Now I can type my last name. And so on every page, it'll say my last name plus the page number. I'm going to double click down here again. And I'm going to select all of the text. Actually, uh, my favorite way to do this is to click on Command A that selects the entire document. And now I'm going to click on the spacing indicator and we're going to set everything at double spaced. So now we have a double spaced, properly laid out paper. The only thing left is to put a title on it. Um, for now, I'm just going to say title, but I would like you to come up with something much more inventive than that. And that is what your paper should look like at the beginning. Once you've done that, remember to change your justification back to the left, and you can start typing your paper. That's all there is to it. Thanks.